How's it going, everybody? It's the Max 5 of the Rush Hour Fit Crew. Yesterday, Julius and I, we chatted a little bit, tried to get ourselves together. We're going to do our weekly discussions probably on weekends just because it better fits our schedule. Uh, plus, we had a lot of technical difficulties, but neither here or there. You know, I'm Asian. I'll figure it out. Technology. But, um, so today we're going to talk about gym anxiety and what do I mean by anxiety? Um, so, you know, it's a new year, everybody set their goals and it's, it's not, you know, don't, don't ever feel like, oh, you know, everybody sets new year's resolutions, goals and they, and they drop them and people never reach their goals. So if I don't reach my new year's goals of getting fit, then it's not a big deal because everybody does it right. I mean, that's typically what ends up happening. You know herd mentality everybody else is doing it so i'm doing it but you know this isn't about that because this year's different that's what you told yourself you tell yourself this every year this year's different i'm telling myself this my goal this year is to have some sort of leanness to where i can actually see my abs so a six pack will you um but it's not gonna make or break me you know i have i have a life and so did so do you but the thing is is how do you overcome this gym anxiety that people have? So getting into the habit of going to the gym, not being worried about what everybody's doing, this and that. So let's just take a step back and see, you know, what's it like? You know, what, you know, when I go back in my, my, my mind about when I first started going to the gym, how did I feel when, um, you know, I was the little guy per, uh, uh, per se. So you walk into the gym and you see like everybody's in there they seem to know what they're doing they're wearing matching colors to their workout outfits and they're you know bigger twice the size of a bus or or they're so they're in such great shape that it's like it's intimidating and you look at yourself in the mirror and you're like i can't do this or you feel as if everybody's watching you um and that's and that's you know that's not uncommon to have that kind of anxiety because it's like you know you're new you're new to something so instead of worrying about the gym and thinking that you have to be an expert before walking in you know you just be a little bit more knowledgeable about what you're going to be doing you know the biggest thing is focus focusing on what you want to do so you focus on your workout you focus on that plan and you get it done you know, and there's ways you can help focus. You know, you can bring headphones. Uh, you know, you can maybe get a personal trainer if you want, or you can just try to figure out. For for me, I don't get a personal trainer. Not saying that it wouldn't help. I'm just too cheap. I, I'm very cheap. Um, and I, I feel that you know I have uh, advanced degrees. I can I can look up something and figure out stick stick to something and see what works. You know, I try to do a scientific method. Um, manage one hypothesis at a time I mean one variable at a time in my hypothesis and see how my body adjusts to it so you know if it was working three times th three I, uh, I I'm getting too deep into the into the weeds but my point is let's just focus back on anxiety don't let what other people are doing deter you from reaching your goals because you have to remember they were once new and they have their own individual goals some people want to be bodybuilders some people want to be long distance runners. Some people are just in the gym to socialize and it's like a, you know, a, 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 a um, it's a home away from home and it's kind of that kind of mentality. So what are your goals? You have to first write down your goals. Um, literally it will help, but, or if not, jot, I jot, I jot mine down in a, uh, in like an electronic journal, my notes or something like that. Um, write it down you know and 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 break it down into to manageable bites so if your goal this year is to lose 50 pounds by the end of the year that sounds daunting that sounds hard break that down into five pound increments you know so when can you reasonably see yourself losing five pounds so if you lost five pounds for 10 months that's 50 pounds right or you know however however you think it, you can manage it you know but or you can you can break it down and you slow you can you have to make it manageable you have to make it approachable when you so first write down your goals make it important make make the gym a priority make it to where it's as easy as possible so to overcome anxiety any kind of anxiety is to really overcome fear and to overcome fear it means you have to become knowledgeable 
Um, read up about what workout are you gonna do this day and why it's important. Read out, read up about what diet you're gonna do and why it's important to help your body. You know, you have to become knowledgeable because if you're not knowledgeable about it, I mean, you know, you're gonna constantly be afraid. I mean, really, really fear is just, it's just the acceptance of ignorance. That's all it is. And that, that comes for, that applies to everything. So anyways, it sounds like I'm ranting, but, but just to kind of just give a heads up, everybody has gym anxiety. I still have gym anxiety, especially when I'm going for big lifts or I'm going, having to do stuff for myself and try new workouts. But I always know that, you know, as long as I'm aware of what's going on, what's going on and not focusing on what's going on around me, but just focusing on the weight in front of me and pushing as hard as I can and giving it my best, then I'll be fine. So today, that's pretty much the gym anxiety I want to talk about. But let me know what you think. Uh, tell me what kind of fears or anxieties you've had in the gym and what do you think you could do to, what did, what did you do to, to help you become more, I guess, more comfortable. All right. Signing out. Uh-oh!